Once hailed as the ninth wonder of our cosmic neighborhood, Pluto stands at the brink of existence and identity. But what secrets does this icy orb hold? Is it a planet, a dwarf, or something entirely different? Let's dive in. Deep in the edge of the solar system, there is an object of mystery, it's extremely cold and was once defined as the coldest place in the solar system. Once the ninth planet, it's what we know as Pluto. Pluto was first discovered by an American astronomer, Clyde Tombaugh, in 1930. It has not yet orbited the solar system once because it is too far away from us and has a long orbital period of 247 years. Because it's so far away, scientists could not conduct a detailed analysis with the technology at the time in 1930. This resulted in the mass of Pluto being subject to ongoing adjustments and updates. The only thing that is certain is that Pluto is 0.22% the mass of Earth. Before 1992, the status of Pluto as a planet was undisputed. It was generally accepted in the literary circles that Pluto is the ninth planet of the solar system. But from 1992, astronomers continued to explore near Pluto in the Kuiper Belt. More new celestial bodies were discovered, such as Orcus, Makemake, and Eris, and the masses and diameters of these new celestial bodies are almost similar to Pluto. This means if Pluto is a planet, then the number of planets inside the solar system is likely to increase to dozens. It can be said that at this time, the astronomical community began to realize that in the past, planetary definitions were too broad. So in 2006, the International Astronomical Union redefined stars and the conditions for planets must be met sufficiently for the following conditions. 1. Orbit around the Sun, the body must be in orbit around the Sun. 2. Sufficient mass for hydrostatic equilibrium, the body must have sufficient mass to assume a nearly round shape. 3. Clearing the orbit, the body must have cleared the neighborhood around its orbit. These are the three rules of the so-called clear track. In the future, Pluto will have no space due to its small mass and lack of other celestial bodies in cleared orbits that have been eliminated as a result. Among the planets, the International Astronomical Union has a special classification called dwarf planets. The purpose is to arrange those with the mass volume of Pluto similar plutonoid objects, so Pluto is from the planetary position after being placed on the planet and retreating, it was classified into the dwarf planets category. The solar system has only eight planets to date. In fact, 26 years ago we didn't really understand Pluto. But we do today and all this is thanks to the United States New Horizons Pro. New Horizons was launched by NASA in January 2006, an unmanned outer space probe launched on the 19th. Its main purpose is to detect Pluto as it goes through nine years until July 14, 2015. New Horizons reached the vicinity of Pluto at a distance of 12,500 kilometers, flying past, this is the first time for human beings to do this observed it at close range and transmitted back the clearest photos ever taken. Let us see the true diameter of Pluto, which has also been accurate to 2,370 kilometers, and the surface is even more a cold world with temperatures as low as minus 229 degrees Celsius. The point is that under current astronomical regulations, Pluto may not return to the ranks of planets in the future anytime soon. The solar system will always maintain the pattern of eight planets at the time of this video. If you liked finding out about Pluto and feel sorry for this little celestial body, give us a thumbs up and subscribe for more daily Eureka Science Sauce videos. Thanks for watching.